Yeah, welcome back again to the channel. My name is Arnold and so I've been recently listening into King Madi and Bujo. You know, these are Nigerian artists and I'm kind of inspired by their sounds, which is why I want to get into today's video and make a bit uh, emulating what they're doing and uh, it's more of an Afrobeat, a modern Afrobeat tutorial. So yeah, stick around you may learn something new you know so yeah and don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you're new here amazing grace how sweet the sound i love electra and there is this preset from the keys it's called the uh, chosen part and that's why i'm i'm gonna start my beat off with so i'm gonna start off with So I have this beautiful chord progression and sharp minor E A and D and it sounds beautiful. There's a lot of tons of songs that carry this chord progression and so I'm gonna leave it like that literally. Mm -hmm. So uh, I want to layer this one with something smoother. Okay, found a beautiful one. This is the heavenly part from Expand. This is how it sounds like. Super nice. And what I have on it is a, an EQ and then uh, I've cut out the higher frequencies and I've cut wider onto it just to give it a stereo with this and, and yeah. The reason why I bounce it into an audio track is because sometimes, you know, choir stuff or is linger around when it goes to another, uh, when it plays another chord. So keys from E, what, the transitions right here. So let's say you're coming in from um, F sharp and you're going to E, you know, uh, F sharp lingers around, you know, they always have that tail thing. So that is why I bounce them into an audio track to, to, to avoid that. So. I like that. So I want to have a guitar melody going beneath this one and I think I'll go in with labs. To be honest, I've, I've fallen in love with uh, with labs. I mean, it's my to-go plugin currently with the uh, guitar stuff and to go with the flow you know sometimes the melody just sounds in your head and you just want to put it right you know implement it right away and have it you know playing so that's why i try on different notes there is no uh, magic here i'm just working through the scale so have it very repetitive so i do have a few variations around here but they are, they are not that much okay so i do have this right here so bounce it into an audio track and give it some afrobeat instruments and afro villa sample park so i wanna have these both playing the same thing 
right here. So with this one, um, I have them play something like this. So I have this rhythm going on, but it sounds way dry. So add crystalline onto it. just having all these percussions laid out together to create that unique vibe you know so beautiful uh, I'm gonna add two things before I lay down this beat one is the lead and another one is the bass so So yeah, I'll sign out for now, but don't forget to subscribe to the channel and turn the notification on because bro, I've got a lot coming. So I'm signing out for now. Peace. As always, I'll see you in the next one.